Get over here! Hey, you're that some bitch Dutch was going on about. You a registered voter? Ah, don't matter. I need help of a different sort. Let's get to the point. You see that steaming pile of disappointment over there praying? That's my loin fruit, Herc Jr. Dumber than a coal bucket. He takes after his mama. Stupid some bitch went and lost my campaign truck, Nancy. So named after the greatest first lady to ever serve this fine country, of course. If them Obama-loving libtars find out I can't look after my own property, I can kiss this Senate run goodbye. Now, seeing as you're on my land, and I didn't kill you, even though it's well within my rights as a red-blooded American gun owner, I say you owe me. Help numbnuts get my truck back so I can start focusing on my campaign again. Junior! Someone's here to help you. Try not to fuck it up. Hey, Migos, it's me, Herc. Do I start, like, praying to myself, then? Something like prayer inception? Man, I need to get that movie. How am I supposed to get this? Ah, uh, hey, man, I'm sorry. I don't want to go on assuming nobody's gender or nothing. I, I mean, I don't mean no disrespect. I just call all my homies dude or bro or man, you know, regardless of vegetarian or penile-ness-ness. Whoa, deja voodoo, man. Have, have we have we met before? Dang, man, my prayers have been answered. I got a direct line to that sweet little monkey god whose heart hangs in heaven. Well, I guess since you're an angel working here on Earth, the Monkey King, that you already know I gotta get my daddy's truck back. I mean, he's real butt sore. But if we get it back, he'll let me sleep in my bed again. And I gotta tell you, man, it's getting real cold outside. Never mind them wood ticks crawling all up in my junk. Threatening me with Lyme disease and whatnot. So come on, man. Help me get my daddy's truck back. Let's make dust before the old man starts shooting. He's hotter than a ghost pepper these days. Santa Run's been real stressful on him, man. He ain't cut out for that shit. You know how busy he is? Doesn't even have time to cut out for his shit. Shit, man, I've been praying on this all day, man. I've been asking the Monkey King, all the baby Jesuses, even the Bill Valentine's one, just to send me a sign, man, and they sent me you. I'll tell you something, though, man. Getting that truck, it ain't gonna be easy. Damn, Colt's gone. While we're honest with you, it all started when... When I tried to join them, I mean, I mean, it just seemed like a good idea. I mean, they had all these guns, food, fine-ass females, and I mean, those are three things I'm really all about. I mean, it seemed like one big party over there, you know? So I says, I said, hey, Migos, where do I sign up? He said, sign up right here, friend. Then, <laughs> then, they start listing all their dang rules, man. No fornicating. Turns out that means fucking. No, no alcohol and no wild out partying, man. No thank you. So I got the fuckity fuck, fuck, fuck out of there, man. Unfortunately, though, I forgot my daddy's truck. He's been real butt sore since, so you gotta get that truck. But you don't gotta worry about a thing, man. I got a nine-step plan to get in this truck back. Step one, catch a day buzz on party liquor. Got that one covered, home. Step two, Pray for someone else to solve my problem. Done. Step three is... Uh, shit. Shit, I forget the rest, but... They'll come to me as soon as, soon as we go. Dang, you are a good listener, Boba Fett. My old man doesn't listen at all. I guess that's why I never feel hurt. Me and him, we ain't getting along that well lately. Ever since he started running for office, he's been coming down on me real hard about everything. About my public intoxication, how I handle my firearms, stuff like that, man. But when we get his truck back from them Peggy's, he's gonna be real impressed, dude. He's gonna love me so much, and then my mom's gonna have to try and love me more so she can compete with how much he loves me, and then he'll see how much she's loving me, and then he'll try and love me even more, and then birthdays and Christmases, they're gonna be off the chain. This is the place. Oh, I just remember 
something I've been cooking up. Another dead piggy. Great fucking idea! Change your bitch! One less piggy. You got it! On the move! over here. Man, I love the theater. Okay, man, now it's time for step four. Truck's actually all the way down yonder. Probably more Peggy's waiting for us, too. It's all about the zip line, man. We gonna zip line in there, sneak up on them like ninjas. Somebody up there likes me. Man, don't dwell on that shit. Fuck yeah, man! Oh, shit, stealth mode, right? Fuck yeah, man! This is the shit, man! This is so much fun, man, I won't come back later and do a fuck naked! Doesn't matter how much they try. Karate, bro! I'll be honest with you, man. I took my parents' divorce real personal. I know they say it ain't never the kids' fault, but man, I took it to heart anyway. Ran away from home. Dude, I, I was terrified. I had just turned 30 years old and I didn't know what I was doing, man. I I mean, there was a thrill that came with being a runaway and a freedom that I cannot explain. I mean, that's where I found myself, and that is why I recommend running away to every child I meet. The cult trains their soldiers up in these mountains. They got the home. My daddy says Jacob's corky in the head. So I suggest you don't mess with him unless you have. Watch my back. Okay, I'll do it right now. Change in position. Same as before. We gonna do something about that. Cover me! Move it out! Doesn't look good. Knock him down. Nice work, Migo. Okay, step five. Let's move before more show up. Guess it's my lucky day. We did it. Change of position. Oh man! Oh man, we got trouble. Reach for that there cooler. 
see if we have any cans of whoop ass left. And pass me a beer if there's one. Hey, Miss Rock. Hey, Miss Rock. Hey, Miss Rock. Hey, Miss Rock. Plants always needed. Roger, going in. Hey, Miss Rock. Would you look at that? Two peas in a goddamn pod. Glad she's still in one piece. Well, Deputy, you kept your word. You know, I did some thinking while you were gone. This whole Senate run is too much for me to handle on my own. I'm in need of a campaign manager, and you're just the kind of go-getter I need to get my ass in office. First task I got is to take Junior with you wherever you go, so I don't have to hear him praying to that goddamn Monkey King no more. Second task is, uh, well, uh, let me think on it a bit. I'll get back to you. Well, buckle up. Now's your chance. 